This is Curve Riders, and I'm Alexa Harnagel. The sciences are known for being hard, like really hard. Like, fall asleep over your textbook and cry during finals week hard. It's hard for everyone. Even science majors, chemistry major, physics major, it's still hard, because it's a new way of thinking. Every single chapter is new. Now we could probably agree most fields are men dominated. Chemistry, physics, and biology are. So add in the stress of needing to prove your gender good enough to be there. To top it off, imagine being in full habit. Everyone knows your religion and your dedication to God. I'd say women like this like a challenge. They like being underestimated and proving their peers and professors wrong, especially in the 60s, 70s, and even now. Sisters like Mary Kenneth Keller and Veronica Maher did this. They stepped into a system dominated by men and worked for the respect and status that they held. Sister Mary Kenneth Keller got a Bachelor of Science degree in mathematics. Right after that, she went to work and study in Dartmouth. This wasn't very common because women weren't typically allowed to help out or work in the computer science section. And in 1965, she was the first woman to receive her computer science degree, and she got it from the University of Wisconsin in Madison. This is why Sister Mary Kenneth Keller was sort of a big deal. Women weren't typically in the computer science industry, but she pushed her way in. She made it clear that she was going to do this because she wanted to. She was very progressive and cleared the way for women to do this in the future. This is not to say every young woman needs to go into a science field and change the game, but it speaks to the confidence that women need. We need to trust our passions and work for what we are passionate about, and that's what these sisters did. And not only do we need to trust ourselves, we need to trust God. What we can take from these sisters, whether we want to be in a business major, a fashion major, a language major, is to be inspired by the movement and change that they were a part of. We can continue on to be great things and put a dent in history as long as we can leave those who doubt and believe in the road we choose to follow. Brought to you by Sister Story and their sponsor, the Conrad M. Hilton Foundation. All sound was collected at American Residue Records. A special thank you to Garrett Tiedemann and Alicia Beyer for your contributions, and be sure to check out the podcast, Here's My Secret, by Alicia Beyer.